There we go. Story mode. I knew I'd get far enough. I'd figure it out. Hey, Andre. Good to see you here tonight. Everything's been a little off. Uh, I, I tried to go 60 FPS here for a little bit and screwed everything up here a little bit. But other than that, it's been a very interesting day. Complete live action scenes. I'll do goals and mural. Can you lock all the pieces? Okay. Let's see who we're going to go with here today. Oh, it's all these new characters. Hmm. Not played season one? Maybe I should. Who should I be tonight? I've done, well, you know what? I haven't done full gore for the, oh, Saber Wolf. You know what? We'll try Saber Wolf and then see, maybe I'll get another uh, scene out of full gore here. Ending one, complete story mode. Ending two, ultra combo thunder. Ultra combo, I'm not getting number three, but that's okay. Yeah, that's fine. I'll live with that. All right, here we go. Saber Wolf. So, Andre, you're in the chat here, and uh, I want to thank everybody else who has. Uh, I'd say the biggest news that came down today in terms of stuff I would normally cover is uh, a promoter that normally runs out of heat out of Alberta. He's based out of Manitoba. Uh, he just released a video of an article done by Rebel News. Hold on, hold on, let me just read through this here. Having endured agonizing procedures to remove his freakishly cybernetic implants, Saberwolf feels no closer to reclaiming his humanity. Barely clinging to sanity, nurses an addiction to ancient medicines and artifacts, which seem to slow his descent into savagery. All right, let's see what we got here. Omen right off the bat. Hmm. Fight on. So I don't know if you if you notice, but uh, one of the promoters that runs out of Edmonton quite well, St. Albert quite frequently, just put out a video uh, from a YouTube article that was put for Rebel News uh, that he got fined for doing a show in December by the Manitoba government. Before the Herald of Gargus. For me, that was nuts. Sorry, I tried to learn a new character here that I haven't played before. Ah, I missed it. And the audio is off between the computer and the street in front of me. So. Boy, that's the way to combo out of that. Oh, you play. Oh, you play Valhalla. Okay. Andre, you have fun with Valhalla there. I will, uh, I'll see you probably on Friday here. We got a big match announcement coming up. I got you on video here coming up this Saturday, so. 
Uh, you will, uh, you'll like the match that I got pulled up for you here. Yeah, I'll be putting it up on social media once I get the commentary done on it. So. So, uh, all right, well, we'll see you then, Andre. Uh, but in other news, like I said, the NHL started up today. Unfortunately, the uh, Montreal Canadiens fell short to Toronto, which all of us were a little upset about. Watch out. You might get cut. All right, here we go. Mix it up. I'm not getting that cop. There we go. That's a nice combo breaker. I love that I have auto combos enabled because my uh, water jug just decided to fall over on me here. And... Damn it. There we go. Took me a while, but I got it in there. Unlock the color of Saber Wolf. Nice. Weekly quest to hand in. Always good as well. All right, we got wolves versus dinosaurs, so. Fight. Yeah, I say I don't mind. I actually like doing a lot of these story modes here. It gets you a little bit of a, a little bit of a feel for the game a little bit more. So, Orchid, you in there? Uh, you're on. Good to see you here tonight, by the way, my friend. Actually, my main is typically Fulgore for me, but. I'm trying to mix things up a little bit here. get a little bit more of a feel of what I'm doing here. Yeah, I think once I get going here, I'm, I'm going to try to go through the story mode with all the characters. I'm 
just glad my wrist isn't buzzing with games from the, things from the Oilers here losing and whatnot, so. I felt better not to watch the games tonight, so. So, I have to ask, if, if you're a player of Killer Instinct, do you play it on the PC or do you play it on the Xbox? I love the ultras. And the best part is when you play story mode, there's no nobody teabagging ya. I had this one guy last week sat there and wanted to teabag me the whole time. I'm like, ah, no. Okay, the audio's a little bit off here tonight, guys, just so you know. There's a slight delay in the audio here, so. Just trying to close up some extra stuff. Maybe it could catch up on its own here. All right, where are we at now? Oh, here you go. Here's your character, Jaren. I was looking for. Oh, 
I keep missing that last one. Noticed with uh, Saber Wolf here, he's there isn't much to his character here. All right, let's get going here. Now, oh, we got thunder. Fight on. And I think Orchid was one of the harder endings we had to pick up, right? So, what go if now you have to move? Getting myself up there slowly, it's just taking some time here. Alright, here comes the final one. This is going to be a battle. No, it's not. Well, I can tell by my chat group that uh, Yamamoto scored, so that's always a good thing. Nice uppercut. 
I'll get more of those odd combos. Alright, well that's the way to end it. Let's see what kind of ending I get now. Bloodlust reawakened to combat. Oh shit, sorry, correct. The age of the wolf begins. So all he was trying to do is convert himself back to a man, and he couldn't because, oh, well, we got another piece. So now we get to see Kilgore versus Jago here. I do love this music, by the way, but I find that when it comes to a guy like uh, Saberwolf here, he's he's an okay player. He's not nothing anything spectacular, but uh, I, I couldn't find all the special moves that he has, so it gets a little frustrating on my end. But we'll see what happens here. It's a lot of fun trying to go through all these characters and try to uh, try to understand what their moves are and what what their character is behind their game and how you're supposed to play it properly. Like I remember playing Cory last week, uh, Uncle Touchy. If you check out the uh, VODs, I completely screwed that up how I played him. So. When you're uh, when you're Glacius, you're supposed to keep your combat wide. But I was going right in on him, and that that's just a complete stupidity on my part. All right, I think we had enough of that already here. So let's see if we can move on to. Uh, All right, let me just do a quick switch here, guys, of uh, scenes. I want to see if uh, doing something like this will help. Nope, the audio's still shot tonight. Oh, well, you know what? It happens. You guys can hear pretty well. The, the audio's a little bit delayed for where it should be tonight. But you know what? We're going to get through some more of these stories here and see how these look. Okay, so we got the secondary ending for Saber Wolf there. You know what? I think... Let's go with Spinal. Creepy little... Welcome. 
So complete story. Ultra Combo Saber Wolf, that's the second one. And have a hundred percent shadow efficiency in a single match. Spinal! I always gotta use the first one because it looks way cooler. And we'll use the second uh, variation. Awakened after centuries and under the control of the ancient artifact, Spinal Soul Quest is to find the Mask of the Ancients. The relic used to give him life and bind him to this world. Spinal's hope that once it is in his possession, he'll grab his freedom. All the man wants to do is die. Can't you just give him his dying wish? No pun intended. All right, DJ Combo. Fight on. I remember playing the original Killer Instinct. The DJ Combo was my main main. So I do have some experience with Spinal. So. And you got what it takes to beat the champ. Come on! Oh, he's gonna do his counter shit, okay. There we go, that's nice. It slices, it dices. So I gotta sit there and watch that light. What his ultra is, though. I love the face of this guy. over to Glacius. Now this guy, I gotta make sure I get it tight on. And after this, I'm going to uh, reboot the system and uh, I'll sign off for a little bit, then I'll sign back on here because this audio is a little... It's a little rough playing this while I'm trying to... Oh, 
kill you off in a hurry. Go. Now I got it there. Okay, that. It's a little rough here watching this, but. Stylus Pyro? Keep getting all these little co extra bonuses. Ooh, Spinal. Alright, what do we have up next here? Watch out, you might get caught. Ready. I love getting in there with that foot. It just seems so easy to get in there with just the... bit impressive here. All right, what do we got now? I think we got two more and then we get to the, uh... oh no, we're early yet. We're only at number four. Kara! Spins in the sand, always in hand. You make a fine specimen. Ready.
we'll take a few extra hits out of this. the south of the uh, picture's a little off here right now. Take that, thank you very much. My shadow efficiency is only 50%, so I I ain't getting any specials out of this. Uh, maybe I could Ultra Orchid and then uh, get that second, second one here. Or no, it's Saber Wolf, that's the one. Damn it. I was almost close to a perfect crowd there too, you little big scum that have to fish you off. One button off, guys. Sorry. Supreme victory. I made level ten. Here we go. This is the one I have to ultra. I will say this, my controller is getting some work, that's for sure.
subtlety of the background music here too. Damn it! No ultra! Supreme victory! I got the Supreme but not the Ultra, so it looks like we're going with level one uh, storyline here, so. Then we gotta take out Fulgore. Let's go, Foggy. Finish it off, boys. What the hell? Ah, I thought it was far and done there. Sorry. All right, what do you got to say here, buddy? Might have to change up the aesthetics here a little bit. No Saber World Match in this case. Vital succeeds in recovering the Mask of the Ancients. Returning to his ancient lair. His Vital destroys the Mask of Regus soul forever. Peace washes over his final and he joins his ghostly crew. Aww! Vanishing with the outgoing tide. Aww, be still my heart. All right, we got another piece. 